Welcome to Math with Mr. J. In this video, I'm going to cover how to divide integers. Now we're going to be incorporating both negative and positive integers in the four examples that we're going to go through together in order to get this down. So let's jump right into number one, where we have 21 divided by negative three. Now at the top of the screen, we have some very important information about how to solve these. Um, so if we have the same signs, so a positive divided by a positive or a negative divided by a negative, we will get a positive quotient. If you have different signs, so a positive divided by a negative or a negative divided by a positive, then we end up with a negative quotient. So let's do 21 divided by negative three here. And we can just think of it as the division fact, 21 divided by three. So that gives us seven. Now, in the case of number one, we have a positive divided by a negative. So we have different signs. So that is going to give us a negative quotient. So our final answer is negative seven. On to number two, where we have negative 10 divided by negative two. Let's just think of this as 10 divided by two, which gives us five. Now we have a negative divided by a negative. So number two would be same signs, right? Negative and negative. That's going to give us a positive quotient. So our final answer is a positive five. Number three, we have negative 16 divided by eight. So again, we can think of this as just the fact, 16 divided by eight, which gives us two. Let's look at our signs. So we have negative divided by a positive. So different signs equals negative quotient. So our quotient or final answer there is going to be a negative two. And lastly, number four, we have a negative divided by a negative. So negative 25 divided by negative five. So 25 divided by five is going to give us five. Now let's determine if that's going to be a positive quotient or negative quotient. So we have negative divided by negative. So same signs there equals a positive quotient and we end up with a positive five. So there you have it. There's how you divide integers. I hope that helped. Thanks so much for watching. Until next time, peace.